Welcome to TCM. Thanks for joining us. I'm Ben Mankiewicz. In 1969, British writer Graham Greene published a book about a stuffy banker caught up in some unusual adventures with his wildly eccentric aunt. The book became a bestseller, and up next we have the 1972 Hollywood adaptation. From MGM, it's Travels with My Aunt. As he was writing, Graham Greene began to think his book would make a good movie. Even more, he thought Katherine Hepburn would be perfect playing the aunt. Green even recommended the story to Hepburn, calling it, in his words, a book made for films. Then, when the screen adaptation was offered to director George Cukor, he signed on specifically because it would give him one more chance to work with his great friend, Katherine Hepburn. And Hepburn herself not only signed on to play the part, but personally wrote the screenplay, spending weeks, then months, crafting that screenplay at her desk. And then a funny thing happened, or maybe not so funny, because that's what the studio said about Hepburn's screenplay. Not so funny. Not surprisingly, Hepburn lost interest in playing the role when the studio lost interest in her script. At the same time, some at MGM began to suggest that Hepburn was maybe too old to play the part anyway, given that she'd have to appear younger in flashbacks. So in the end, it will not be Katherine Hepburn, you see, playing the delightfully eccentric aunt, but Maggie Smith, who earned an Oscar nomination for her performance. From 1972, also featuring Alec McCowan, Lou Gossett Jr., and Cindy Williams, who'd go on to play Shirley on Laverne and Shirley. Here's Travels with My Aunt. <laughs> 